Your girl is feeling her and her little spidey senses today. That's what they said. <laughs> Y'all, he's a mess. So we decided to come to um, Papa Do to get us something to eat. We was gonna go to Cheddar's, but we don't feel like going way over there, so Papa Do it is. Here we go. All right, see y'all on the way out. Yum yum. What y'all think I look like with red hair? I'm getting ready to actually dye this hair red, so this is gonna be good. The girl is gonna go red for the summer. My spidey senses are starting to kick in and say, go red, go red. <laughs> We're about to get our food, chat. We ain't order much. What I got grouper? I got grouper this time, y'all. They is doing the uh, spinach and crab dip. Look at a lump crab in there. Lump crab in there. And I'm going to do the um, grouper and truffle potatoes. And uh, then I got me some drink. So, yep, we'll be up out of here soon. Let me show y'all what it's looking like. Papa Doe. They're trying to send me their baby showers. What? He asked me um today, or yesterday, the other day, was we coming still? So I told him we going to uh, try to shoot for the birthday. Yeah. What he said? The date on it? Or the song? Keep going dancing. Have a good time. I don't know y'all what y'all think of this red. I think it's cute. I think it's cute. It go good with my spidey senses too. I'ma try it. ready to go to the house take all this stuff back to the house and oh lord jesus <laughs> um don't wait no bay to put some gas he filling us up gonna fill us up but um yeah so back to life you know um this has been a crazy experience although the house isn't completely ready yet um you know, it's just been a crazy experience, but I appreciate life. You never know where God going. God always going to have you where you need to be exactly where you need it to be. Okay. Um, and that's one thing you just got to humble yourself. Life may not go as you expect it or as you want it to. However, you have to trust that it is always going in your favor. Everything happens for you. If you 
adopt that mentality that everything happens for you, you'll be able to get through whatever it is that you're going through. Everything happens for you, even if you get fired from your job. I remember when I was in the workforce, I used to get fired every six months, y'all. It wasn't for me to work for somebody else. It was for me to work for myself. You know, God gave me a lot of creative talents and a lot of, you know, energy, a high frequency. And he wanted me to utilize my natural talents, you know, um, as a form of not just assisting this world we live in, but, you know, as a form of um, developing, inheriting income as well. So, you know, I do that. But back then before i adopted that mentality i used to be like what's wrong with me like why is it so hard for me to hold on to a job like what's wrong with me what's wrong with me every six months y'all and um i understand now every it was happening for me it was god showing me yo get your together hey hello wake up hello 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 so look in your life and see where you are the most uncomfortable because that's what god trying to talk to you right now that's where he's trying to give you the message the clarity the information the knowledge that's where you need to make your next move on Okay, if it's love, if it's finances, if it's health, if it's family, if it's self-love, is if you know, relationship with your kids, fertility, like really look into where it is you having, you know, some hard time right now. And give that energy some love. Put so much love in that area of your life and watch it change like this. No, you didn't say I jump on live every five seconds. Calm down. No, you did not say that. I know you did not. Trap, you think I go on live every five seconds? I ain't been live all day today. Why are you trying to defend it? Why are you trying to say it? You will. Come on. Come on what? If I say it, Look, talk, talk to the people. Let them know how you feel. Let them know how you feel, Travis. Talk, talk to the child. You Look at the people and, and let them know how you to feel. To call Tyler. Come on, man. What you calling out for? I need. I got to. I got to tell them something, mother. I left my phone home. I just said that. Uh, just answer the phone. At, it's at six o'clock. So answer it. If a phone call come in around that time, just answer it. Tell them to call my number that I'm, with, I'm, I'm on now. All right. Thanks, Tyler. All right. <clears throat> People say they still ain't, People ain't understand why you jumping. Nothing. You ain't got up in this 7 Eleven. No, I just saw 6 Eleven. You said 7. I look at that one in front of us. That's the same one you saw? This one's 7 Eleven. Oh, shit. I got to get over. Come on, John Jacob. All right. Y'all, they finna take me out to eat. So I'm in good spirits. <laughs> finna go get something to eat. Eat. Your girl looking like 1990s the, to the nine nine. I feel like juvie right now. <laughs> Bingo. <laughs> you way too much. Shut up. Why would you do <laughs> Y'all, that's an insider baby and petty, okay? Petty boots today, honey. Cha. In the in in all colors. Petty boots today. But um, shout out to y'all. I just threw on some. I got all these little graphic little shirts. This one say Back to the Future. Y'all seen me with my um Spidey Senses shirt. I wanted some graphic tees. It's summertime, you know, but the twins was kind of like, you know, making fun of me because they like the way I wear graphic tees. Like, why would you wear a graphic tee with that hat? What is, like, you know, they think I, they telling me that I dress a hot mess. In other words, they saying I can't dress, okay? But they stood up for me now. They stood in the paint for me. They say, look here. <laughs> One thing about that wifey of mine, honey. But um, 
Nah, the twins was kind of like, you know, making fun of my little outfit. Like, why would you wear a graphic tee with that? Like, you supposed to wear it with jeans. That's what y'all do. I wear a graphic tee with a nice little silk skirt. That's just my style. I'm just, you know, I like to have a little bit of youthful fun, but to a nice, sophisticated look. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't trying to go too you know young with it i like back to the future that was one of my favorite movies you know and um you know then i throw my little shades and this is how i do graphic tees but you know they calling it a little you know let me take this off this is that with that noise um they call it a little you know i don't know they don't understand it they want me to do it how how they do it you know what i'm saying like with jeans and maybe some 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 vans no absolutely not i got on heels i got on manolo blonics with a graphic tee yes i do <laughs> i wear a graphic tee with my manolos oh grr. yes the hell i do i'm not wearing no vans i'm sorry but um yeah they finna take me out to eat shout out to my hubby just getting off from a hard day's worth of work, honey, and he finna just enjoy wifey. You know, we back home, so I've been kind of straightening up all day, and I'm pissed off because you can't even tell, y'all. I did so much, and you can't tell, but I get down to the nitty-gritty. Like, I clean that deep, deep, you know what I'm saying? I'm the type with the goddamn uh, Q-tip going around the goddamn uh, 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 sockets and stuff. Not the inside of them, y'all, okay? Going around the sockets to get all the dirt and stuff. Like, they go deep, too. He like to get the little, you know... Uh, make sure ain't no cobwebs and stuff like they clean up all that stuff like that like he go and get the ceiling fans and you know the top of the ceiling and the top of the curtains and stuff like that he do all that deep cleaning so y'all know how it is when you drive like damn that hour away just to go to another tj maxx or ross <laughs> that's what i did yes the fuck i did okay so she grew up and I'm gonna see if they have that bracelet. Remember the one I was telling y'all about, the Gucci link? So this is an area kind of like a little country, you know? So maybe they have it, maybe they don't. Maybe they will, maybe they won't. I'm not sure, but I'm gonna damn sure see if they do. So, let me see what all they got in here, y'all. And I'm gonna um, get back to y'all. They got some cute stuff though, I ain't gonna lie, but they don't look like they got it. Hold on, let me show y'all. I like these, they're on clearance. Those are cute for summer. But I don't see it, y'all. I was finna get this before, that white thing. That's cute. I don't see it. Oh, look at this. Now, I like this. I love that. I think I like that. Hey, look, it's silver and gold. That'll go with my ring, my bracelet. I think I'm gonna get that, y'all. I like that right there. Let me see. Let me see if they have it. Oh, they go to, I got that one on right here. They got the heart puff. Oh man, it don't look like they got it over here, y'all. All right, maybe the next TJ Maxx. Y'all look at it. Who, who know about them old bass? Hold up, let me let them see. Who know about them old school Reeboks right there? And they clean. <laughs> Y'all don't know that about that. Ooh. 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 Sexy. That's that Miami boy. Oh, they don't know nothing about that right there. That's my Manolo with my, um, Manolo and my, uh, what is it? The graphic tee. So we had Cheddar's. <laughs> hey, y'all. Hi. It's just, yeah, just us two. I like that color here. Get us, gonna get us some to eat, honey. Yes, ma'am, we are. Right, let's see. Oh, this thing low. I feel like we made it. Mm. That look cute. What y'all would drink? I like that. I don't know what I'm going to try. Of course, I'm going to have that Caesar salad because y'all know that's my favorite. That's my favorite. But, um, I don't know. Let's see what I'm going to get. What y'all, do y'all eat at you? What it is? <laughs> what, chicken? Yeah, that chicken look crazy, honey. I don't know. Look at that. 
just something about it. I don't know. I don't know. They just brought that out. It looked like they say limited time, honey. Yes, they did. You know, switched up. You know, switched up the menu, honey. So, let me figure out what I'm gonna eat too. I know I'm gonna get my salad, but I just don't know what More than likely, I'm gonna get the same thing. It's this right here, but I don't get the um, baked potato. You see it? It'd be the salmon, the rice. I don't get the baked potato and the broccoli. Let's see, y'all. I'm in um, Ross right now. Tell me when they changed everything around. Like, I don't know what's up with that. So, but this is the line, y'all. Okay. They don't change everything around up in here. So it looks like I'm gonna be in here for a little minute waiting on this um these lines to pass. But yeah, I got on my little fluorites. Okay, as y'all can see, for patience, focus. <laughs> Cause I'ma need it up in here. So after this, I gotta leave and go get the girls. Um, from work, they're gonna be getting out in a little bit. And if I would have known this line was gonna be this long, I wouldn't have been in here this long. But um, I gotta get what I gotta get, and um, then I'm gonna go back to the house, do a little bit of cleaning. Look at this little peach body butter. Okay. Yes, get it. Uh, A M N H. I wanna smell this. Y'all know how it is when you gotta look at everything that's on the sides and stuff while you're in the line. I'm getting a little closer, so. Let me go ahead and be nosy. I'm gonna check in with y'all in a little bit. Y'all play too much. What y'all think? <laughs> Ooh, go get this. Chicken noodle soup. For real, y'all? It done came to this? To get the kids to buy artificially flavored? What in the world? <laughs> oh God. But y'all who hungry, honey, thank you. <laughs> but y'all who out here hungry, you know, just letting y'all know. Ross got you for the college students. <laughs> oh, this is pretty, y'all. Look at these. I like these. These are pretty. Somebody must have picked them up and put them back down. I like these. They only eight ninety nine. So, yeah. all right, let me get up out of here, y'all. All right, we out here scouting for food today. We supposed to be on our way to the gym. Okay, yesterday I didn't um, go to the gym, so I did like about four thousand um, steps. So we in this Jamaican restaurant. Yes, my daughter want a Jamaican patty, and I want to see if they have some curry goat. Me want rice and peas and curry goat. <laughs> My daughter be laughing every time I say it. So yeah, let me show y'all what it looks like. I want to see, you know, that juice be natural. Oh, that cake just be looking good, girl. I'm telling you now. I ain't lying. Oh, child. Somebody ain't got no chicken tenders. Jerk salmon. What? Honey jerk salmon. Why are you looking like that? It says twenty ninety nine for honey jerk salmon. Twenty ninety nine. I just want some meat though. They patties look like they fresh. So anywho, um, yeah, when I leave out of here, the mall look is right there, right across the way. That's the mall. And um, y'all got curry goat. I just want some curry goat. Y'all have it in um, like a container? Yeah, I'm gonna just take some curry goat. Yeah, like a, let me see. Uh, I'm gonna take, how, how many ounces is a large? Eight? Yeah, how many ounces? Do you know how many ounces that is? Yeah, like is it 16, 12, like the size of it? We don't sell rice stuff. We give it, um, we sell the curry goat with rice and peas and Oh, see, I want. I just want some curry goat. Um, yeah, I don't want it on top of no rice. I don't want no rice. No, it's like it's like it's in a container, which means that the the the, the curry goat is on like a side. Okay. Yeah, let me just get a side of curry goat like that. No. All right. So I had to wait for my food, y'all. I'm gonna taste so patty. Why are you looking like that? I don't eat the beef on the inside. I do. I shake it out. 
Oh, it's fresh. So I'm gonna leave him. Go to um Saks, return these ugly ass glasses I bought. They round. I like more of a square. So they moved my room at the hotel. I got a big room. So we checked out, right? Went to the house, but that mildew smell? Mm -mm. I can't do that until they finish. So we back at the hotel. For probably about another week. I'm not sure. Yeah. So, um, yeah, we back at the hotel. That mildew smell, honey, is messing with my appetite. Like, that's why I'm trying to eat food, food. Because I can't. After I eat, I feel very nauseous. And then it's just like, like the need to throw up. Um, my mouth get real watery, like I'm gonna throw up and stuff. And I just, I don't like that. And then it just, I don't know, my stomach just, something ain't right with uh, my appetite. So, um, energy wise, you know, I've been trying to go to the gym. I, I didn't go to the gym yesterday. So I'm going today, but um, yeah, y'all look. <laughs> I um look at my little nails, y'all. Y'all know I stopped with the um what you call it because I want them to grow. I mean not grow but get healthy. So I put these little nail things on there just to kind of you know give let my uh, nails breathe for about a year, and then I'm gonna go right back to acrylics, child, all the way clawed out, honey. <laughs> but yeah, my daughter is gonna be um doing my nails and stuff for me. So, I'm we'll gonna go right back to acrylics. But I needed them to air out because they had got real thin. I wonder if my food ready. It's ready? There it is. Oop, there it is. There it is. There it is. All right. Thank you. All right, let me show y'all. Y'all stop like this. All right. Y'all. So. I'm eating, but I don't know, y'all. It ain't giving what I wanted to give. I'm really not for the crunchy cabbage. You know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna eat a little bit of it to put something in my stomach, but I'm not for the crunchy cabbage. And honestly, the um, ox, I mean, the uh, curry goat here is giving oxtail, okay? Mm. I don't know why. It's not really giving me um curry goat, but let me let me taste it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's good. I'm gonna give it to him. It's good. Look at that big ass bone. It's good. Um, I like my plant just kind of burnt, cooked soft. This one like it's fried a little hard. It's actually a little mushy. It's a little mushy. It, it, it's, it's not. Mm. But, um, yeah, I kind of like the other place I be going to better. I ain't really, you know, this one here ain't really giving me satisfaction. Yeah, this cabbage is a little too crunchy for me. But, all right. Y'all, that was a waste. All that bone, bone, no meat. That one piece right there was dry as hell. Uh, this is too crunchy. This is too mushy. And then look, why all the um, patties got, uh, let me see if it focus. Look, it got plastic in it, y'all. Let me see. Y'all yeah, probably can't see it, but those are, look, look, you see that? It got plastic. Look at that. Pieces of plastic inside of the um, the patty. And it's like, she 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 like patties, but she's been noticing that. One of them had that long piece. Remember that last one? Ooh, it had a long piece of plastic in there. So y'all just be careful out here. And this is either giving oxtail or, um, you know, kangaroo knee or, you know, goat ankle. I don't know. I'm not really familiar with the phone, y'all. See, it look like a little hoof. I don't know. I'm like, ooh, child, that look like a little hoof. I ain't never had no, you know, goat look like this. Look at that. That look like a damn spine or a little. Uh, knee 
I don't know, but ain't no meat on it, child, whatever it is. And this here, I don't even know what that is. It's just pure, I'm not sure. I don't know, there's no meat on this, none of this. So this is like a waste of $20 right here, okay? So that's going in the garbage. And we finna get ready to get on up out of here. I don't think they have a garbage, but let's see, maybe on the inside. I'm on my way back to the Le Hotel from Le Gym. So they changed my uh, room because the AC went out in the other room. So they changed it. So I'm in a different room and I gave the twins my old room. So I'm on the other side. Instead of 407, I'm at 404. So I'm on my way back from the gym. I'm gonna just take me a shower. And um, Tyler. Oh, you gonna put that in the room for me? Okay. Um, This room is a little teeny weeny, teeny weeny bit bigger than the other one. Thank you, baby. See, so I got more space. Y'all remember the other one was a little claustery. So this one here, look at the bed and the window. And then I got just the windows are a little smaller. So yeah, that's the bed. And it's hot in here. I turned it on um 60. I don't know what's up. It's on 70. The lady must have. I put it on 66 before I left. And Miss Thing must have put it on 70. But, um, yeah, remember I told y'all I got shoes, okay? Here they go. From Steve Madden. There's some cute little gym shoes. They have little stones on them, y'all. Okay, some little stones on them. Mm hmm So, yeah. Um, I'm gonna lay, yeah, she been half ass and I ain't gonna let her to bed. Look at that. I feel like she lay on it when she done. You know. I gotta catch up to my energy, y'all. I gotta pull my energy up and um, drink me some water. Shower, because I'm just getting back from the gym. And um, y'all, let, let me relax. I'm not doing that at the door. What the? Not you kicking everything out. <laughs> she coming like the damn eviction people with all my stuff. Look. Uh -huh, and then you got this, and then, uh-huh, and then it. Is that all? Yeah. Is that all? She took all my charges. <laughs> Let me get you. All right. All right, let me hook everything up, y'all. Hold up, I'll be back. So, anywho, y'all, first of all, I did good. These are my steps for today. 10,000. Uh, 596. Now, why that look different? That say 10,609. Oh, shit, it went up. Okay. There it is. For today, 10,609 steps for today. Kudos to you, girl. Now, here's the T. I got on the scale 201.5 pounds. Y'all, these mother. Snacks. Look at this. Sh this is four weeks of snacks. Look at this. Look at it. They refill it every day. Okay. They refill this. Sh this is the devil. All this is gonna go. All this is gonna go. Okay. I, I don't. I don't want it in here no more, y'all. Two hundred. And I could tell because when I eat it, I don't feel like doing. Sh I don't want to go to the gym. I don't want to work out. You know, my eating habit get a little unhealthy. I told them damn snacks up y'all for the last couple of weeks. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, I just need a little bit more discipline. Drink that orange juice, okay? Need a cocoa. Let me get that. Yeah, just need a little discipline. Uh, remember, they give you the free breakfast and all that stuff. So all that eating, y'all. But I really haven't been eating the breakfast that much. But I do need to, I guess, cut back. Continue to drink more water. Okay? Because I do need to drink more water. And um, I just got to have discipline on what I eat. 
I gotta cut back on the candy, the snacks and all that stuff. Cause you, you wake up in the middle of the night and between Netflix, YouTube and Candyland over there, child, your girl be busy. Okay, don't be getting no damn footage, just busy. But I do edit. So what I do is I edit and eat. I edit and eat. You know what I'm saying? Gotta cut all that out. Yeah, I gained seven pounds since I've been in this damn hotel. Seven pounds. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of it. I am. I'm gonna get rid of it. I do this all the time. I'm like a pro at this going up and down, up and down. You know, it's just that discipline. Now it give me something to achieve. I got a goal now. You know what I'm saying? Between that and getting these eyebrows done, you know, time for that maintenance again. You know, once a week, eyebrows. I gotta do my chin. Yes, honey, your girl gotta pluck the chin. Okay, I wasn't born fabulous, but I stay fabulous because every day I invest in myself. Okay.